Hi, this is Candy Shaw with Tips and Tricks Tuesday, and I'm going to show you something that I do a lot. When you actually have been covering gray for a long time and you get a lot of band marking in the hair, and of course this hair is dark and you want to keep it dark, but you actually want to equal out and even out some of the, uh, the banding that's been happening through um, formulation, through uh, water, different things that cause the hair to adhere better in some areas and not. I'll take my lightener and I do a process just where I skim the hair. So just come in here and I don't actually hit this band here. I don't actually hit where I'm going to touch up there. And I just come in and I just actually skim through this hair and take out some of those dark lines. Once I do that, I actually don't put any perforated plastic in between this hair. I just simply skim throughout the whole head of hair, picking the hair up, not putting the plastic in, to pre-lighten that hair prior to doing my base color. Then I'll place my base color onto the regrowth and then come back and tone it with a demi-permanent color on the ends. What that does is it just gives the hair a lot more life, a lot more shine, and it gives it variations in tone. So if I just come in and just lightly skim through some of the darker areas of the hair, just almost like a dry brushing technique, where I just pull it around, skim out, drop it down onto my paddle, and then again, not putting any of the perforated volley wrap on top of it. Once I go through this, I'll wash this out, place my base color on, and then tone or glaze the hair. This just gives browns, brunettes, and even redheads a beautiful, luminous look without seeing streaks or highlights. Stay tuned for more Candy Shaw with Tips and Tricks Tuesday from Atlanta.